Hello! Today I will teach you how to turn your very own art into stickers, and even acrylic keychains or standees. There are so many ways to go around with making your own stickers. You can even make one at home with a scotch. But we are taking a more professional route of making stickers. So if you plan on selling your art in artist alleys, Etsy stores, then this tutorial is for you, as I will try to simplify the whole process. Okay, so just like I said before, there are so many ways of creating stickers. You can always use your own printer, but as someone who does not have a printer, so that's when suppliers come in. I, of course, used Vogue's to create all of the set stickers, keychains, acrylic standees, and yes, this video is definitely sponsored. So how do we go around the process of making all of it? Well, it's very simple. Just make a drawing of your idea that you wish to turn into a sticker. I think when it comes to stickers, there really shouldn't be a lot of scaling limits. I've seen all kinds of stickers that have different sizing, color schemes, and they all worked out pretty well. But if you wish to go for a very visible and clean design, I suggest fitting your drawing into a square shape, aka making your drawing more chibi, or just avoiding drawing full body. But I personally did not follow this method, but wanted to point this out just in case. So now we have a finished drawing that we want to turn into a sticker. I'll be using the Vogris website to showcase the entire process. Vogris has a very simple system that lets you order custom items of your own art without talking directly to suppliers, and then they have an entire section that is fully dedicated to all kinds of stickers. So what if you have decided to turn your art into glittery stickers? First of all, you'll be met with this page. And on the right side, you will see these options. Materials. This one is very clear and there is only one option here, which is glitter, so we choose that one. Then comes sizing. I would recommend going for 2.5, as it's the golden middle for a sticker. Not too tiny, but also not the size of a palm. As for quantity, you can moderate the amount of stickers you want, preferably in this area. I would also like to mention that the amount of stickers you order will affect your given discount. So if you order 100 stickers, you will get a 40% off discount. And the final step. Upload your art by clicking this button and add to cart. That was pretty simple. And if you're interested in making more than just stickers for a possible artist alley or an Etsy store, I would still very much recommend Vogris as a supplier. Their website is filled with so many options. You can make your art into keychains, acrylic stands, pillows, button pens, and the list goes on. They even have an entire artist alley set. At this point, they for real got everything you need. If anything seems to be complicated to make or you're possibly lost when it comes to sizing, they also have a blog that comes with so many instructions on how to prepare your art before submitting, entire process is very new and user-friendly, so you won't be lost when using Vogue's as your supplier. Not to mention, they also host discount events, and they have an entire VIP membership that you can get for an entire year, which offers discounts all year round, and more, so it's very likely that you can snatch a deal. So if you're interested in creating your own stickers with Vogue's, check them out. All links will be in the description, and have fun turning your art into stickers.